The application of magnetic fields in the medical industry often get us thinking of MRI in medical imaging. But do you know that it is now also gaining more attention in the area of abdominal surgery? This started off with magnets being used to anchor surgical devices onto the abdominal wall and to guide them into desired position with full mobility. This concept also kicked off the local magnetic actuation method, which utilizes external magnetic sources to actuate the internal surgical devices from across the abdominal wall. In this study, electromagnetic status are used as the magnetic sources. A pair of status actuating a corresponding rotor drives a single degree of freedom on the robotic surgical manipulator. For realistic surgical tasks, Multiple stator rotor units are needed to drive a multi-degrees of freedom manipulator. These stators generate magnetic fields to rotate the rotors embedded in the internal device, which in turn actuate the surgical manipulator. In a surgical setting, the stator rotor units have to be placed close to one another. Due to the close proximity, magnetic interaction would occur at any point of interest within the vicinity. When only one unit is switched on, the corresponding rotor rotates smoothly. However, when a neighboring unit is powered, the interference will affect the rotor of interest and hence affecting its rotational speed and the motion of the robot. Therefore, this disturbance has to be rejected so that the rotors will run effectively for accurate manipulation. Although, only partial information of the interference signals is known, such as the waveform but not the amplitude, a disturbance model can be obtained. We can then use the internal model principle, IMP, to reject the effect of the interference. By augmenting the original state space model of the LMA system with the disturbance model, an observer which estimates the disturbance can be built. With a good estimation, the controller can then attenuate the disturbance. We then applied this IMP controller onto our LMA experimental system and found that the disturbance due to the neighboring status was almost eliminated. We are so excited to share more of our findings with you during our session. Thank you.